Nearly 24 hours after cracks of gunfire silenced the morning buzz at Pearl High School, Luke Woodham stepped into the sunlight for the first time since being arrested. Security was tight. Police officers flanked the Pearl High sophomore and he wore a bulletproof vest just in case. We were concerned about his safety as well as anyone else's. It was just a precautionary matter. Uh, we didn't feel it, you know, it was a, a, anything would happen, but we wanted to make sure, do everything we could to protect him in case. Woodham took an uneventful ride to the Pearl Municipal Court. It was in stark contrast to the wild ride police say he made just a day earlier. Police say Luke Woodham killed his mother, then drove to school. He allegedly brought a gun with him, and a little after 8 Wednesday morning, police say he used it. When the shooting was done, two students lay dead. Seven others had been shot. There were more reporters than spectators at Woodham's court appearance Thursday, where he answered charges of murder and aggravated assault. Luke Woodham showed no emotion as he answered the judge's questions. He said that he does understand the charges against him, he entered a plea of not guilty through his public defender. It lasted less than 10 minutes. The judge denied Woodham bond. He'll once again see the light of day October 14th for another court hearing. Meanwhile, people in Pearl look for help in putting the pieces of shattered lives back together. Chris Pallone, JTV 12 News, Pearl.